Hello and welcome to my garden. It's a very sunny day. What a day to start a fire. I'm going to be making ashes. You need to have a lighter, the heat source. And there's oxygen in the air all around us. And the material you want to burn to make your ashes. You also need a container and incinerator. I'll be using lint from the dryer. That will help start the fire. But I will not be showing the starting of it. So, the fire is burning in there. You can see the, you can see the smoke. Yeah, you can see the smoke. Yeah. The fire is. Listen to the crackling of fire. There's a hole at the bottom. You have your bucket of sand, your bucket of water for safety in order to take out the fire. The chimney is reducing the smoke. Can you imagine this bin was can you imagine this bin is completely full? Yeah. Fire is a good slave but a bad master. Remember that. So we'd leave this for 24 hours. We're going to make sure the fire goes out before I leave here. But I'm not going to touch it until tomorrow. Then I'll come and get the ashes. Here's the ashes. I put out of the estimator to just put it into the lid. And I'm going to sift it. This mask today is, comes in very useful. That's charcoal. We're going to use the pesticide, pesticide covering to make our yam seedlings. This is the charcoal that did not completely burn. I'll use this to make activated charcoal. I'll need to make more charcoal. This is too tiny. Well, this ashes is enough to make our yam seedlings. Watch that in my next video. I hope you understood how to make ashes. Thank you for spending time with me here. 
please like leave a comment and subscribe subscribe comment and like bye